Hi, I'm Mark, owner of Pure Water of Watsonville. So I want to explain the whole house filtration system. It comes in three parts, a water softener, carbon filter, and reverse osmosis. The water softener removes the calcium from the water. The carbon filter removes chlorine and the reverse osmosis is trying to remove 100% of the other minerals, other contaminants in the water. In practicality, it's gonna remove 90 to 95% of the minerals. And it has three parts, a tank, filtration system, and a dedicated faucet for the pure water. Under the kitchen sink is where we typically mount the reverse osmosis and, and storage tank. The filters and tank can be up to 20 feet away from where this faucet is. So it's possible to mount the tank and filter in the basement or in the garage and run the pure water line to your kitchen, freeing up some space under the sink if that's an issue. There's other faucets uh, with different styles and finishes to match your kitchen faucet. So depending on what you have on your kitchen faucet, we can usually match our pure water faucet to your kitchen faucet. Water softener comes in two parts, uh, the resin tank and the salt tank. So this is where you're gonna be adding your salt. And there's two kinds of salt that you can put in there, sodium or potassium salt. Potassium is okay uh, in the on your garden. So if you're watering your plants, you wanna use potassium. It costs more for the potassium, but it's better for the environment, better for your health. When the city water flows through here, it's doing an ion exchange to exchange the calcium with the salt. Removing the calcium makes the water soft. The carbon filter is a cartridge filter that you'll change once a year. This is a carbon filter that fits inside of this housing to remove chlorine. There's as much uh, chlorine in the air in a 10 minute shower as you would get in, a, in drinking eight, eight ounce glasses of water. So that chlorine gas that's formed in the shower is harmful to your lungs. So you don't want to shower with chlorine in the water. So a carbon filter removes that. Um, so these three parts solve 90% or more of the problems in our area. If you have other minerals in the water, say you're on a well or there's some problem with the plumbing where you're seeing red or black stains or smell in the water, then you may need some filtration before we get to the whole house filtration system.